everyone, let's go book shopping, shall we? Hello friends, I'm gonna go on a book shopping adventure today with my friend. So I thought I would take my vlog camera and not just do it on my phone. I usually do like these short mini TikTok like day in the life videos, but I thought I would bring my camera along today so we can have the adventure together. So before I head off, I'll show you my outfit of the day and then we can go book shopping together. Here's my OOTD semi fall. I have this like knitted sweater but it's like not a full sweater so perfect for fall so yeah that's my OOTD got this off a of Shein a Target like bodysuit it's very cute and then my Target jeans some bow slides and a book tote bag just so we could go book shopping so that's my OOTD I also have a pretty bow in my hair that you can't see. You'll probably see it later on in like the video with me like turning around out the book. So that's why I wore a bow. But yeah, that's my OOTD. If I could tell you, I don't think you'd believe how long I felt this way. I'm begging you to stay. And if I could show you, I'd hope that you could see All the possibilities, there could be a place for you and me And under the stars, you pack up your car Cause you're going far away from spice anything so what did I get a pumpkin spice frappuccino with no coffee with no coffee I don't drink coffee well it kind of tastes like a pumpkin pie <laughs> there we go <laughs> that's a better angle oh what did I get um, we just peanut butter cookie. <laughs> it definitely tastes like one. Cheers. Reese's cup. Reese's cup. <laughs> we have lipstick on today. I don't care. Hmm. I don't think I would choose it, but uh, it's not like terrible, but it... I would and I did. Yeah. If I didn't get this, yeah, that would have tasted okay. It tastes like fall. I don't know how you can taste like fall, but it tastes like fall. It tastes like fall. That's why I'm like, they sell it year round, but it's a seasonal drink. It's 80 degrees out today. Usually we're not that cold. It's actually, we're high 70s today. Ah, uh, so it's a little bit. But normally we're really the cold. The weather's starting to go down. Yeah. Yeah. I was gone from April to June, so I don't know what the weather was. Cold. I was hot. It was chilly. I could still wear a jacket. 
That tastes pretty good. I forgot I never took a video with this. Take a look out the window Spirit goes up as the rain falls down I've been sitting on the wrong course Keeping it together like I did before Think that I've said this a few times Even with that, has it ever felt right? I swear that this has happened every moment Can I just be honest? I was only wondering and maybe we could take it to a different conversation Things will get uncomfortable but only if we make it I just wanna say that But you'd rather take it all back Although you are sunlight, you stay in the shade I'm dancing in the corner just to give me space Cause I wanna believe that I get lost, you go with your day Slowly get closer, but you're moving away I know it's just a recap But I'm sure you'll never see that I'd rather take it all back Maybe it's time to get home Think that it's going a little too far Even left the road, the white noise Oh, I still wanted to restart A fun shopping day and I got to take you to two bookstores. We went to Barnes and Noble and then we went to an independent like mom and pop bookstore again. I went to their other branch uh, last month I believe or in July and now I went to the one that's near me so I had so much fun. I went with my neighbor friend. She lives right next door to me. So I thought I would do a book haul of everything that I got today. Brought my tote bag. And if you're wondering what my tote bag says, it says treat people with kindness. It's like a Harry Styles dupe I got off of Shein a few years ago now, I guess, or whatever. We have my books in here, so I took it today with me. And I'm just going to tell you the books that I got. Pull them out. At Barnes & Noble, I ended up getting two books. I was only going to buy one. I went in there for one book which is this one it's belladonna by adeline grace i wanted to get this one because i heard so much about it on book talk everywhere i because i think the second book came out but the tiktok book club that i joined or the instagram book club sorry and we're reading belladonna this month so i decided to get it and also it has like the purple sprayed edges it's a little ruined but uh they only had one copy left in my barnes and noble but i picked it up anyways i think it was only ten dollars so not too bad that's pretty great so i got that book and then I got Addicted after all. So this is going to go into my Addicted series. But I, I have this in my Amazon card. I'm going, I was going to order it on Amazon when it was going to come out in a few like days. I think it comes out September 5th. But they already had it out. So I was like, I'm going to order it anyways. And it's probably going to be the same amount of money. So yeah, I got Addicted after all by Krista and Becca Ritchie. I believe this is the 7th book so after this one i think they take a break with publishing them so at least i can calm down on my book buying i say that but i probably won't so i'm glad that i got this i was hoping that it might be out so i didn't have to go back on september 5th and i manifested it and that is correct so now it's gonna look pretty on my bookshelf i have all seven books that i can display in my living room bookshelf so picked that one up and I believe it was like $17 so 
got those two books and then my friend got two books as well she got classic books and i'm over here getting romance books of course i mean i don't even know if this is romance honestly i have no idea what this is about like i've just heard that it's pretty good so yeah i mean i should read the back but i don't know oh it is romance it does have romance and i think it's like I'm not sure if it's YA or what is it, but I'm just looking forward to reading this book this month. So that's going to be on my September TBR. And honestly, I might film it while I have my makeup and like my hair done. I mean, my hair fell out because it's so humid. Like this is when my town gets like hot is August, September. Last year it was like crazy, but from the beginning of the year, until like halfway through it's like so cold here so yeah those are the two books that i got at barnes and noble and then at the other bookstore the independent bookstore i got the house of the scorpion by nancy farmer i read this in middle school i believe and i remember really liking it and i have a video idea on my phone uh for rereading books that i read in like school so from elementary all the way to high school i thought i would pick up a book that i remember reading and this was eighth grade i believe or eighth grade english class read this uh let me know if your class did the same thing but i remember really liking this and i hated that we had to read a chapter every day like i'm like i am a book girly i need to be reading books <laughs> like i mean i could have skipped ahead but miss goody two shoes didn't want to break the rules in school so i just waited every day and i remember really liking this book so I don't know it was in like the middle grade section i think is that what you call this kind of book i don't know but i'm going to reread it as an adult to see if i like it of course it's probably not going to be the same maybe or hopefully it is but i have a list on my phone of books that i would like to read again as an adult so yes we have that and i think they had a 50 percent off book sale so this was three dollars and 34 cents for this book which is great there it was like 50 percent off all their books until today august 31st when i'm filming it and it said this is for age 12 to 14 and it was supposed to be six dollars they wrote it in the book but i mean it's pretty good the cover's a little like torn up and stuff but what do you expect it's probably a used book that probably someone actually had to read in school but they just donated maybe so yeah this is a pretty thick book i remember my teacher she just like printed out like i guess she scanned a page and like printed it out for all of us she didn't let us buy the book she just xeroxed it and then like gave us like a piece of paper and we read like a chapter a day like i said but yeah that is the last book that i bought not too bad i didn't do too bad usually i do even worse i really wanted to buy divine rivals the hard copy i have it on my kindle i did start it but i want a true copy and they had one in store but when i went onto the app the barnes and noble app said they were out of stock so i'm like really i could have just went there but technically i think i got it on amazon for like 14 dollars and over there it was like $20 so I'm saving money but it's not gonna come until like next week I believe so I'm kind of sad that I can't get it now like I could have had it in my physical hands and I could have read it but I can't but I am gonna get the book it's just gonna be a week from today so yeah that was my book haul I am going to film my September TBR I the lighting is like okay but i'm gonna get my ring light out so i can film that so that was my book shopping adventure and my book haul of what i got today from book shopping i really hope you enjoyed coming with me and trying my first pumpkin starbucks drink that was an adventure so yeah i really enjoyed today hopefully i can do more like this those were the three books that i ended up picking up today i'll link whatever i can down below in the description as well as all of my social medias my book talk my bookstagram or my regular instagram and tiktok here so thank you so much for watching please give me a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't already and i'll talk to you in my next video bye everyone